Hi, it's Amanda. Welcome back to my channel. It is getting very ridiculously funny how many times I've tried to do this recording and paint this painting that I've had in my mind for a while. It's it's just crazy how many times I've been about to do this and gotten interrupted or stopped for some reason or another. But I'm here. I've layered my cups. I was going to show that, but just layering the paint in my cups took me 36 minutes, so I'm not going to share that video with you. These two cups have light bismuth yellow, quinacridone violet, primary yellow, ultramarine violet, and then benzimidazolone yellow medium. And I have white in between every layer in this one. I skipped white between a couple layers in this one on accident the first time, so then I did it that way on purpose again. Um, these two are in the opposite order. They start with benzim benzimidazolone yellow medium and then ultramarine violet and then primary yellow and then quinacridone violet and then light bismuth yellow. And my reasoning for these is yellow is my favorite color and I wanted a couple colors next to them to make them pop. And I have an idea in mind. Give me just one second. I'm going to need this. I have an idea in mind that I've wanted to do for a long, long, long time. I haven't tried a painting like this. I want to put a cup in each corner. And then whenever I flip it, drag it in towards the center. Like this. You'll see if I do it right. And... I'm just going to get started. I've never done this before using a spatula to flip my cups. And this spatula is a little bit bent, so I'm not sure how this is going to work. I'm kind of afraid that I'm going to mess it up. Yep, I'm already messing it up. Put that in that corner. Try this one in the opposite corner. Whoops, I lost some paint there. And then we'll do these in the opposite corners. Hopefully I can do them a little bit better. Whoa, shit. That's absolutely not at all what I meant to do. This painting has been cursed. I have, shoot, I'm spilling paint again. This spatula stinks, and this painting has been completely and utterly cursed. I don't know if I can scrape that up and put it on there or not. Absolutely cursed. My next thing that I wanted to do was with this gold. That's really pretty the way it's selling, but the next, what I wanted to do while the all the cups were down was go down through the center and across through here. I totally forgot to lay down a white base coat. Crap! This painting is so cursed. I wanted to do a gold that way. I don't know what I wanted to do with the silver, but this paint, this white leftover was for my base coat, and I totally forgot. This one's already pretty much spilled that way, so I'll just lift that up. Darn it! Since we did that color and we spilled some there, we'll lift this one. And I didn't drag very well. So we're... Shoot, I'm losing freaking paint left and right and every which way. It's just going to run right off the side. Darn it! That's what I meant to do with all four of them, was flip and drag diagonally towards the center. And right now I'm just going to let that sit like that. I need to put something under this because so, my I'm not level, so it's already running off of that. still have some paint in my cup, so, well, it's not going to come out right now. We'll save the cup. Is this a spilled cup? Yeah. We'll save the cup and see. 
See how this one goes? Not quite. See that paint? Shoot. I'm getting drips everywhere. This painting is cursed. Cursed, I tell you. Cursed. I know now we're over-exaggerating over going that way. But I don't want to lose all my paint off my sides over here. This one is the only one that flipped how I wanted it. And by doing that, I'm just making mud. Darn it! And I don't have enough paint because I didn't put down my base layer. I don't know what I'm going to do with the paint on my... There's paint here on the table. Paint. I'm losing paint every which way. This is so not turning out how I wanted it at all. I don't even know which way to tilt or what to do because it's so not what I wanted or what I expected. I'm just losing all of this paint down here. Ridiculous. This is pop I was popping some bubbles. This is ridiculous. And that gold paint is so thick. I mixed it up and put it in my um squeeze bottle. It's two parts flow troll and one part paint and then I added a little bit of distilled water today whenever I was starting with my paint stuff I don't even know what to do with this but evidently I didn't add enough water This is going to end up being, I don't know what this is going to end up being, a mess. Oh, I have my corner cutter here. I already lost some stuff over there. But if I go this way, the title of this video should be What Happens When Your Painting is Cursed. I know you can't shoot, you can't see this now of what I'm doing. Maybe I'll just have some negative space. I don't know. Go this way. It's just going to be mud and not at all what I wanted should have known as many times as I've been interrupted trying to do this painting that it wasn't going to turn out. I'm using my corner catcher up there and I'm still losing all this really pretty paint down here. Whoops, now I'm dripping in the center. Absolutely ridiculous. I may not share this because this is not at all what I was hoping for. I'm not even getting that to come down this way. All right, we're losing all this pretty paint over here. Just tilt that way for a while. Stretch some of these cells out down here. It's not really going, is it? Because there's not enough paint because I forgot to put down my base layer. Should get a straw and try to blow some of it out. I'm just going to tip it. I'm, I can't even see it. I'm just going to tip it and let it do what it wants. 
and then I will turn it, tip it this way some. I don't want to tip it that way though. Maybe tip it like this. No. Maybe if I, this white is probably still too thick, but maybe if I put some white, oh, maybe if I put some white around here where it's bare canvas still, maybe that'll, there's some gold coming off of my thing. Pour some white in these negative spaces and see what it does. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm tilting away from the camera again. Let's turn it around if I'm going to tilt it that way. But if I tilt it too much, I won't see it. And just, just kind of tilt a little bit to help that fill in. Help that white kind of move a little bit and fill in. The white's still too thick, the white out of the bottle. Painting is cursed. I don't know why my painting is cursed, but it is. Mm. Where do I want to go now? Go this way a little bit. I mean, I'm fine with leaving, leaving some of the white, like, negative space. I'm going to tilt some and then I may add a little bit more white to fill in a little bit more of the negative spaces. I think somewhere over here, there might be one side where I don't have any paint. I don't know. Yeah, I see it over here. That gold really needs thinned out because it's barely moving. So I'll have to put some more water in my squeeze bottle. Nothing's moving over there. Okay. Okay, let's try this again. Well, this canvas is 12 inches by 12 inches and it's just a little bit too big for me to lean over there and see what's happening. But I do know that I want to turn it around I guess I have to go to this side a little bit. I can feel this getting all over my elbows and everything else. Why don't... No. Hmm. Let's 
torch a little bit because I see some bubbles. still see some of this blank touching up some of these blank spots can't believe I didn't put down a base coat. Can't believe I spilled stuff. I can't believe. I mean, my paint is so thick. I really have to thin it out. Man, there's like no paint on that side or anything. Can't. This did not turn out at all what I wanted. This is nothing like what I wanted. This is freaking completely, utterly cursed painting. Didn't get what I wanted at all. I mean, there's yellow. Yay for yellow. Yellow is my favorite color. But I don't know. gonna have to go around the sides and like smooth in some paint on the sides maybe at least I can get this mess to the center I'm not sure that it's move gonna move much more let's try to go this way a little bit where I can't see it Did the paint move at all? Not much. Let's see if we can tilt it this way any. Nope. Let's see if there's anything I can do. I wonder if I can touch that. Probably not. I need to take paint off the table and at least like get. I don't know. Some of the sides are even going to be bare. Like they're going. It's going to have bare spots on the sides. I don't want bare spots in my canvas though. Why don't I put gold? Maybe take that yellow and put over here on that side. Take some white and put on this side where there's no paint on the side. I mean, pinkish white. I mean, the sides don't have to be covered, but I don't know. This was a big flopping failure. All right.
it. We'll try to get this blob back towards the center. I don't think it's gonna move though. Ah. I think that's it. I think it's a big failure. I had one cup that flipped and drugged the way I wanted it. One cup that I like completely dropped and spilled on the canvas. I don't even remember which one's the one that went the way I wanted it. This one right here sold a little bit. That's really pretty with that quinacridone. Sorry. This part sold a little bit right here with that ultramarine violet. That's really pretty. This section's pretty. And that's some of the yellows that I like right there. That yellow is kind of pretty. This part has the quinacridone violet. That's kind of pretty. This part is a mess. This here is a mess. I like where this orange kind of came from. I don't know if that's from the yellow hitting with the gold, maybe? I don't know. Over time, the more that I just have patience and look at this, I may like it more. But it just... This painting has been cursed from the beginning, so it just stressed me out whenever I dropped it and messed everything up. It didn't go how I wanted, so it just... It didn't go at all how I wanted, and I had such a hard time getting around to recording the video and doing the painting. It's just very frustrating. And my paint is way too thick. I'm gonna have to add more water. I'm gonna have to, whenever I mix up paint like that, not leave it for two or three weeks. These and these squeeze bottles, I may not do squeeze bottles again. I really like mixing up my paint right beforehand. Um, that might have been better. Some of the spots that were empty, I might have been able to use this leftover paint, but I think I'm going to save the leftover paints what I can and what I can scrape up because eventually, someday, I want to do one painting with all of my leftover paints. I still would like to get that back in the center, but I don't think I can. I don't think that's possible. I'm trying here to get this white on the side that's I'm getting from scraping from underneath. I guess I can torch again. A few little cells are coming up over there. I might try this method again sometime, but I'll probably mix my paint up right whenever I'm ready to use it. I'll remember to put down a base coat. I'll try to make sure my paint's not so thick. I'll try to get a better spatula. Okay. Maybe I should have used a straw to blow some of the spots out a little bit. I may have liked that better. Um, I don't know. But I may try this method again sometime. I may try these colors again sometime. Um, yeah, I'll probably try this method again sometime because in my head, it would be really pretty to have like the gold in the center and then the colors coming from the corners towards the center. I need more paint. I need thinner paint. I need better work with my spatula maybe. Somehow I need to get my cups on there without making a mess to begin with. So yeah, I'll probably try it again someday. But I'm not a big fan of this right now. Anyway, I want to thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share my videos. I say that at the end of every video, but really what I'm begging is please don't thumbs down this video. I know that this really sucks. I know that this 
painting is cursed. Um, but please at least be nice, be kind. Um, I know everything that went wrong with this. I, I know how to try to do it better next time. So I just appreciate your view. Um, if you would like to subscribe to my channel, that would help me out a lot. Let me know if there are any colors or any different techniques or any if there's anything different that you'd like to see me try on my channel. And have a blessed day. Bye.